Hey everybody, welcome to another video by Tech Support. In this video I'm going to show you how to create a watermark. And a watermark is basically just a logo in the bottom right hand corner of your screen. Actually it can be anywhere, it can be top right hand corner, etc. But it's just showing that that's your video and that you have the rights to that video. And it makes it look cool. Look cool. So uh, before we get started, if you want to download this cool wallpaper I made in GIMP, then uh, I guess you could say it's my official background. Then just go to xx tech support xx .ucause .com and you can find it there in my download section. So let's get started. Okay, all you gotta do is create a new image. Uh, I'm gonna make my 200 by 200, but it really doesn't matter. If yours is gonna be like a rectangular shape, then you're probably gonna want to make it like rectangular, like you know 500 by 200 or whatever. But very important, probably the most important thing is this is to make this transparency okay click OK and then I'm just gonna make a quick one but take as much time as you want put as much detail in it as you want we're just gonna make a circle that's about as big as a square and we're gonna fill it with black okay and then we'll just go layer new layer transparency okay and then we'll fill this one with red but just make a smaller circle inside of the circle and there you go fill it with red now let's make some text for it uh... this is twenty eight days later and you can download it off of defont.com. Okay, put that in the middle. Make it a color so you can actually see it. And there's my new watermark. Okay, now, first of all, you're going to want to save it two times. First time, save it as uh, just, let's say, YouTube video watermark dot xcf this is a file extension for all GIMP files so when you open it up it'll have all the layers in it so you can go and edit it in without just being like a regular picture so first save it as dot xcf and it should just save like a regular image and then when you go then I'll go save as again and this time we're going to name it dot PNG, which is, you can either name it PNG or .jpg, a JPEG image. Uh, both those are fine, but PNG I think gives it a little better quality, but it does take up a little more space, like uh, memory wise. So you're going to press save, and then it's going to come up with this pop up. So you can just press merge visible layers or flatten image, doesn't matter. I'm going to go merge visible layers, and then just click save. And there you go, you got your watermark. Then you can upload it into whatever um, recording slash editing software you use. Example, Sony Vegas, or uh, I use Camtasia Studio 6. So you can just use any one of those. So thanks for checking out this video, guys. If you enjoyed it and liked my video, then go check out more of my videos and subscribe to me by clicking that yellow subscribe button you'll get fed all my new videos and be the first ones to see them make sure to check out my website too uh, com, and also learn how to make free money at www.moreaboutmoney.tk i'll have all the links you need in the description thanks for watching this video guys Bye.